So um, this one, the Mac Pass problem, is from John Doe. Hey, John. To the Mac Password problem, I found a solution here, and there's a link. Mm -hmm. um, there is a downside, so I encourage you to read carefully before attempting this fix. But here's a link that uh, that you've provided here for a uh, site on Lifehacker, of all places, of course. And it says, and this is this is kind of scary, and yet makes sense, but it says to hold down the Apple, so you've lost the password to your, your MacBook or something like that, or your, your Mac computer, hold down the Apple key and the S button while booting to single user mode, and then type in these commands, and that's going to reset your password for you. So you've got to know your username. But what happens there, as he was mentioning that there's a, there's a downside, is that um, you will lose all the passwords that are stored in your key ring. But of course, if you can't get into your system, that's probably more important than the passwords that are stored for your key ring. So, uh, so keep that in mind, though. But is that really that, uh, that easy to reset a password on a Mac computer? There must be some kind of blanket password that would protect you from being able to just run that on any user on the system. Um, I'd be interested to know that. If anyone can try that on their on their Mac, let us know because that seems like it would be a, a security problem if you're able to do that. I know Windows, there's a lot of workarounds to passwords. If you think you're secure on your Windows system, not a chance. Uh, we had a sis, uh, well, I got a call this week from a neighbor and said, I can't I I can't remember my password. I can't get into my Windows XP system. So I said, okay, well, I'll come over and give it a try. So I went and I looked and. Sure enough, she was entering her password, and it wouldn't let her into her system. So all I did was a quick key combination and typed in one word, and I, was, I had full access to her computer, absolutely full administrative access. So I right-clicked on her user, went change password, and I said, what do you want your password to be? She told me. I entered it in. I logged out, and she was able to log in again. But people don't realize that, that there's so much security... Uh, there's so many ways to get around what what little security you think you have with something like a Windows PC. Mm -hmm. But something like that, what you're showing me there on a Mac, there's got to be more protection than that. Isn't there? Because if I could just hit Apple S and then change the password of any user on the computer without knowing the password, interested to know. But thank you very much for the tip, and uh, certainly for those of you who have lost your Mac password, you can give it a try. See if it works for you and let me know because I'd love to know, but I'm interested to know about the security thing too.